And this is Lawrence Frontera, also known as Punk Rock Skate Dad on Instagram. Today I'm going to go over the G.I. Joe Retro Cobra Front Fang. This is a Walmart exclusive. Um, I'm going to compare it to the original one. Um, mine's almost complete, but not complete. Um, this is the first uh, vehicle and figure that is a completely new mold from what I could tell. And I'm just gonna go over it. Um, here's our box art. Again, you kind of get the idea, uh, the feel of the original from the 80s. Box is much bigger because, you know, you have your figure. Uh, back does have the file card. Um, and a whole new figure, which I have to say, I really do like the figure to a point. That's probably what I was most excited about. Um, I'm gonna be honest, right off the bat, this is a very, this is a huge disappointment um, for me. Um, we've seen re redone things. I don't have one, I wish I did, that look way more modernized than this one. This one does look better in real life. Um, than I thought it was, but I'm still just not satisfied with it. Um, and for $25, you know, it's kind of up to you. So, but let's take a look at it. Let's take a look at the figures um, and let you guys decide. All right, so here we have a good look at the fang here, how it looks, and Here's a nice little comparison to the original. You know, again, this thing is, uh, it's fat. You can see exactly how much fatter it is. Um, I don't think it looks nearly as sleek. It's actually not shorter than the other one, although it, in all the pictures, it makes it look like it is. Um, but to get into a certain couple things here, they did a poor job with the missiles. Um, it's hard to believe they could make a missile nowadays that's actually harder to get on than the original ones, but these two actually stay on. I can't get these ones to stay on. Um, not without feeling like I'm just gonna break this thing right off. Um, so again, uh, very disappointing. Um, when you're struggling to get something on, and yeah, I'm a 45 year old man, it works out, and I'm scared I'm going to snap this thing because you got to put so much pressure on it. Um, the turret here in the original, as we know, it just kind of turned and it moves all around. This one here, if you don't turn it in the right direction, you can't move it. You know, it's very disappointing. You know, I can kind of turn it around here, but it gets stuck. Um, again, not the easiest thing for a kid to play with, and when they already had one that worked perfectly fine, you go, that makes no sense. Um, I did hear someone complain about the propeller not spinning. I really don't see too much of an issue with it spinning. Um, it just snaps right on. It is thicker. I do like the fact that it's thicker, so it's not going to sag and bend like this one does. Um, but I don't know. I, 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 look at, I, I look at this, and to me... Um, just the lines of it, I I'm just not into, uh, you know, for $25, you can almost go on eBay and you can pick one up for, you know, 45, uh, one of the original. Now you don't get the figure. Now I do like the figure. Now let me try and get him out here. Um, he's not the easiest to get in. A another flaw that when you're trying to fit the stuff in here, his feet barely fit in. It's going to be a struggle for me to get them back in, but, you know, for the video, I'll do it here. Um, it does come with a pistol, a little sidearm pistol. It already um, in the box. His helmet barely stays on. That's disappointing. Um, that it bar barely stays on. I do like the way it looks. I was really hoping that the mask would come off, but it's all one piece but it is nice to have a nice new figure that actually goes with your fang now if you like the fang and you like the figure you know for 25 dollars you're gonna get a figure you get a nice little you know a nice little helicopter to create a nice little army for your cobra um 
But for me, I'm very disappointed in this. And this is the first time um, for the vehicles, the three vehicles that have come out, I can say I'm disappointed. Um, especially when we've seen the modern tank on, take on the Fang already, that looked really nice. Um, you know, you do have your bomb still, uh, a little different. They made it two pegs. I have a feeling they do this so they you can't put the old one on. I, I don't know why they do some of that stuff. Um, but again, it's, you know, it, it's up to you. Um, I, you know, again, I, I really do like the artwork of it. Other than I don't really care for the thing. Um, but I like the artwork. It gives you a feel. It's all modern. It's all new. That is nice. But I think they could have done a, a, a better job. And so here we have the figure. And just to try and get him back in. Which is. Uh, it was a lot of fun to get in. You know his feet. You know you, you really have to wedge him in here. Um, and just say hey you know what. He's not coming out. Which makes a little sense considering there's the peg for his back there. Um, a, a couple of people complained about the the knees, and I will I will admit, like I had a hard time bending them at first. And you just have to take your time with the knees and the elbows. Just go really slow. Take your time, uh, and you know it, they'll bend. And I've also heard from some of the other figures. I think there were NECA figures. Someone was telling me uh, you soak them in uh, water for like five minutes or so, and then they loosen up. That might be another way to go. I haven't tried it. Um, but I was told with NECA figures, they, uh, that's pretty much the only way to get them to not break. Who knows? So anyway, this is your Fang. Um, it, it's okay. You know, again, for 25 bucks, um, I might just, rather than buy this one, just go out and spend a little bit of extra money and get 1984 fang i just think they look nicer um way nicer to be honest but it's up to you um all right so let's finish this up all right so there you have it that's my fang review um i really don't want to bash uh, hasbro for what they did um but i also can't just Tow company line. I don't. They don't send these to me. For sure, that's for sure. Um, I don't want to tow company line. It's great that we're that. Well, if you can find it, I, I had to pre-order this. Um, now I was, let me say this really quick about. I've heard people complaining about uh, Walmart and how they sent them. Um, quickly, a side note. Um, mine came in a nice box, and I've actually ordered a couple things from uh, Walmart for the toys, and they come. I have not had one that hasn't come packaged nicely. Um, so I've seen people where they say that they're throwing in a bag. I haven't seen that. Um, I don't even know how you could even fit this thing in like a bubble wrap. So I have not seen any issues from the, the few things that I've gotten from Walmart ordered. Um, they actually took pretty good care of the figures um, that I ordered. I didn't even do a review on them. They're, just, they're so, some of those are disappointing. Uh, <laughs> but uh, anyway, Again, if you like it, great. You know, I'm not going to discourage someone to go on out. I, I love the fact that we're starting to see G.I. Joe's kind of on, on the shelves. Um, hopefully, we're going to see more soon. Um, and I don't want to discourage. I want people to run out and get it. But, I mean, you know, you had this one. And this is, you know, you, you had a modernized one. You could have done it. But you gave us this one. And, and I, again, you see, I didn't even try and put this on. I've struggled for two weeks trying to get this thing on it just it falls off and you know honestly i'll go in that gi joe room two three times a week sometimes um and thing just falls off and i'm just it's just sitting on the aircraft carrier because i'm just so aggravated with it um so anyway there you go i also didn't put all the stickers on it i, I just I, listen as much as we run around looking for these things put the stickers down for me i, I don't find fun and putting stickers <laughs> anyway uh, i hope you enjoyed the video again instagram punk rock skate dad um and i hope you liked the video and have a great night